All right. Everybody asks me what I do to get my abs the way it is. Here it is. After a few, you know, 20 minutes or 15 minutes on the step machine or the treadmill, I get right up on this uh, dumbbell here, put the chain around my neck for some added resistance, put my legs on the bench of the seated row, and um, I put my knees to my chest. And I do this about three to four sets, 20 reps, maybe 25, depending on how I feel. Sometimes I'll do five to six sets. Uh, I like to challenge myself, so that's why I keep the chain around my neck. You know, keep my body going and training hard. And, you know, I've been working out since I was 14 years old. So I'm always going to do things. And everybody who knows and works out and loves to work out is going to challenge themselves. So, you know, putting chains around or putting a plate on, on your back would always be something that's helpful. Okay, then I move over to the, the, sit, the sit up bench. And uh, I use a 45 pound bar. Why? Again, like I said, challenge me, challenge me. I've been doing this. I can sit here and do this forever without no weight. So I put the dumbbells or the barbell or the plates behind my, my back and hold it. But now this makes me have to hold the bar so it doesn't fall off. So it stabilizes, make me challenge me to keep myself in a one motion. See how I'm moving slow? It's because I can't make the bar sway. So it kind of makes you have to really focus on keeping your abs strong. Then I move over to the captain's chair and do some old school leg raises. Look at this. Everybody's done this before. And um, that's right, I use a little momentum and I pull my knees up to my chest and I squeeze and I exhale like an accordion and I squeeze my abs. And this is what's been helping me out. And this is what I do for abs.